What is up, T-Town gang? We are back on some WWE Champions. Um, I'm noticing a lot of people are having difficulties with the versus mode because it's been glitching in and out. I did do a uh, video before uh, with the best technique to uh, get your notoriety down really quickly. It is a little grind. I apologize. I keep putting that in a horrible spot. It is... A little bit of a grind but it is definitely your best bet and it you don't have to rely on anyone but yourself to do it so I always pick my two lowest uh, champions you throw them in there you start a battle you wait Till either the match is completely started or just for your champion's entrances. And then you close the application. The reason I am remaking this video is because it, I'm guessing a lot of people haven't seen my previous video that I made that in. So, making it again here, we're also going to open up some loot from the Sunday Night Heat and some briefcases and victory loot. Um, yeah, sorry I don't have better content for today, but, you know, it's just the normal Monday Night Raw, tomorrow's, uh, new limited tour should be out, so I will be on that. So after you force close it, obviously you open it back up, then... We will check and see how we did. So, versus. And if you didn't know, there is a uh, limited time versus event. I like how they do it on Sunday nights when most people are done with doing their verses. So, uh, kind of uh, makes you have to get on the game and grind if you uh, actually want those. So, if you go to offense. We lost, and where did our notoriety go to? So we lost 24 notoriety. So basically you do this like 10 times and you'll go down like 200 to 300 notorieties depending on the match. Alright, let's see. Seven shirts off of another loot opening. Alright, we have no victory loot. Let's do our briefcases. Know what I can do though? I can open up one pack with the cash that I have. So I do have all the tokens for a brand new three star, but um, I actually don't have all of his moves up sadly so I am waiting on some showboat training posters and then we will have a brand new three star there we go we got one let's see let's see some more cash all right let's do this you know Randy Randy wants to come home with us uh, just kidding. Alright. Let's uh, do our token bags and see what we get. I'm just going to do the rares and the, I believe, epic. Yeah. So we'll do the rares and the epic. And then... Not bad. We'll need those for uh, three star Seth Rollins. We need those for Ric Flair. So soon, in the near future, I'm probably going to stop using my cash for the Mega Superstars and just start spinning it on the, uh, not bad, uh, the uh, token bags. I have been asked in previous videos. Uh, on like comments in the previous videos on how to actually find the token bags. I showed it before, but I will go ahead and show you again. So you, 
go to level up or info depending on where you're leveled at with your character you click on the token that you need and now it'll show you where it can be found which you can go to that I actually have no idea what uh so that match right there well that's funny I actually I'm on that match anyways when we make our way back I will if you look right below the section that it says uh, found in, it will show you a loot bag right here. Rare showboat token bag. And in here, you have the uh, chance for the four star silver, which I haven't got any four star silver tokens yet. I don't know why these... Uh, Enhance can be found. I don't know why these are the little uh, symbols. What really ticks me off is when I put use the cash and I get coins. Almost every bag I'm guaranteed to get like a thousand coins, and I'm like, I didn't buy that bag to get coins. But guys, that is everything I have for this video. If you liked the video, hit that like button. If you aren't part of the T-Town gang yet, hit that subscribe button. And if there's anything you'd like to leave down in the comments below, feel free to do it. And I will see all of you next time. Peace.